blessings good day everyone happy wait it's saturday why am i thinking i'm getting the days i'm so like far gone in the spirit and you know by me i don't check really the dates enough like i know we're going into september but I'm, I'm, I'm so far gone with the Lord that the dates and the days of the week and then by me not being employee also like kind of throws me off too. You know, I work from, from home and I work for the Lord, okay? So, um, good day, blessings to you all. I hope you all have enjoyed so far your weekend, your Saturday, that you're resting, that you're resting. Some of you women of God, God have called to a rest, a rest to receive. Every now and then, it's like busy, 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 so much doing, 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 um, helping, ministering working and things like that but god has called you to our rest so welcome back to prophetic minute prophetic healing ministry with angel um where we receive healing and deliverance healing and deliverance where we change our hearts where we where we, we change our heart we clean up what's inside of us not just our outer appearance and that we are judging righteously not about the outer appearance, not about what a person lips look like, not a, what a person clothing looks like, because God knows the heart. Those people that judge people on their outer appearance, God is going to deal with them and God will make the corrections because that is another thing that um, is a distraction from like God's goals and plans for you. Um, it's just a distraction. It's just a distraction. And God will use and send whoever he chooses. Because God is the one that makes the choices. But I'm just here today to give a message that your promise still stands. You, you, you have fasted. You have did everything that God... You, you have been repenting and you have forgiven and you're fasting you know you have because it's an emergency it's, an, it's a breakthrough happening whether it's a breakthrough with you and your life something you are breaking off and being delivered from any like bloodline curses generational curses or maybe the enemy is coming up against you um, um, the spirit of darkness the kingdom of darkness and God sees something maybe it's happening to your God or name spouse and, and he has called you on that assignment to stand in the gap and pray for your God or name spouse to break off these curses that has led your spouse astray for many many years and you might not see any action in the physical Going on a fast does not always mean something when you finish a fast. God is a genie in a box, a genie in a bottle that um, you will see something great just happen. But something great did happen. Anytime God is fighting on your behalf and you are um, in alignment with God and obedient to what God has told you, you don't know how many mountains you have moved because of your prayers and being obedient you don't realize how much closer you are to being connected and being one with your spouse in the physical in the natural because it is god that joins you two together Stay in the second or oh, third lane for right ever that may look because it's not the way everybody think it's supposed to look it is not just this traditional um marriage God does things and everybody, God does things in everybody marriage um, differently. Use the right two lanes to take a slight right turn to merge onto Lord Route 1 South toward Dover Beaches. The same. So don't let no one discourage you and tell you that 
how God is moving in your life. It's like right turn. You know that you know that you know how God is moving and you is ten, 10 toes down. And in about 12 miles, kick left onto Route 1 South toward heart. Express Lanes. A righteous holy heart and your hands is clean. And you confess things to 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 God that you repent. Not only are you saying these things, but you're showing yourself approved actions, the fruit, abundance of grapes. God keep highlighting abundance of grapes, abundance of grapes. He has showed me and highlighted grapes then you are on the right track. You are on the right path. And God's saying your promise of your God-ordained marriage is, is happening for you. And to stay connected to God. That's what he said. He says, stay. The word is stay connected to God. Listen. Silence the voices of naysayers, liars, deceivers, of people around you. And stay close to God if everybody around you leave you because you are walking with Christ stay close to God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ glory be to God we thank you Father God that we don't have nothing else we have you and you are compassionate you are loving you are kind you are the one that redeems and protects if God has called you away from a ministry or a church Remember, you have God. He is backing you up. God is the great defender. He is defending you. He is your witness, the angels, because he knows the people around you are cruel, are wicked, are evil, are deceivers, are liars, are, are, are walking false in falsehood because they're trying to keep up an image. So in Jesus' name, we thank you, Father God, for revealing and exposing the truth, the hidden things with us, our life, with people around us, family. We thank you that the scales have fallen off and what needs to be revealed has been revealed to God's, to the body of Christ, to God's children, to the one that loves him, believes in him with all their heart. But he says, stick with him. You may not see something in the physical just happen just yet, but something happened. You fasted. You were obedient. Trust me, God sees you. He has not forgotten about you. He loves you. His word will not return back to him empty. What it was sent out for to, to do, it will. his word will not pass away. It will come to pass. Because you were obedient. And that was the word that he placed in me. Your marriage promise is coming to pass. Your marriage promise still stands. Wait with God. Wait on God. Be still. Because that door is opening for you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, trust God. Be blessed until next time. If you have any questions, prayer requests, you want to book a one-on-one, -on -one, um coaching call uh just email me in the description box i do have an additional channel he won't have me maybe on here if he leads me but he did lead me to uh record this video and deliver to you all today um this video but i have if you are led by god to cross over and come in alignment with that new channel esther's meeting tent esther's meeting tent that is for all the esters god has been speaking to you about the book of esther and um you are in your the next chapter next phase next level of your like the beauty treatments the beauty treatment where es where esther will be presented to king xerxes you are about to be presented to your spouse so if you are led by the holy spirit follow that ministry and you know um just wait and see what god has for us and what god is sending me 
on there to do. Everything is led by God. You have to see things with your spiritual eyes and your um, anointing and your spiritual ears because everything has a purpose, has a meaning, and everything could be confirmation for you. Anything that I'm doing is confirmation. Like every little, even when I go back and watch my own videos, it's like you can see like, you, you, you just see the Holy Spirit in it. Every little thing. So, you know, just be glad, rejoice, and, and be happy for your neighbors because it's, it's taking place for everybody. And we love everybody. Until next time, be blessed.